Next year's Winter Classic's going to be right. Yeah, <laughs> well, uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully Philly will be a part of it. But uh, if not, it was a great experience for sure. Two points, especially for very much controlling the play for uh, for a huge portion of the game there, and they kind of just kept battling back and stopping up to. Uh, were they both uh, power play goals, or just just, just the first one? But but yeah, anyway, uh, I mean we played pretty hard the first game. And, we just got to keep building off that. I mean, we had a good, uh, good streak coming into this game, and we just got to keep that going. You probably had a good view of it from the bench. Uh, when they scored the last goal, did it look like they had too many men on the ice? Yeah, I actually, I saw when they were changing, when the puck was originally back, it looked like they had a ton of guys out there. I mean, obviously, uh, it's not my call to decide if they have too many guys on the ice, but uh, it could have been that way, I'm sure. Right. Was the atmosphere everything you expected it to be? Yeah, it was pretty pretty good. It was uh, really loud and stuff like that, and uh, the fans were really into it, so that was cool. Even in your days at UNH, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was pretty cool. I had a coach Emilio from UNH was here today, and uh, I'm sure he had a great time watching the game. Anyone else from your uh, family come today? Yeah, I had brothers, uh, parents, and some buddies come out today, and they're all excited to be here, so uh, that was pretty cool. We're moving and, and getting into the town. Uh, you know, we've been able to do that the last uh, two, or, two and a half weeks, and, and you know, the, the wind calm obviously shows that, but uh, you know, we're getting pretty cool tennis and lates and uh, playing pretty well defensively. But, uh, the biggest thing is, is just moving our feet and, and attacking all over the ice and playing aggressive. Okay. Yeah. After the first match, we started playing more aggressive stuff. I saw Martin Jersey. Yeah, I think uh, we want to. You know, I think uh, within within his system, yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, I think we're still still in its infancy. We're still learning, we're learning a lot. We're learning as we go. We don't have a whole lot of practice time because of the. Uh, Schedule that we have, but uh, you know, as we continue to move along, uh, yeah, right, we'll get better. Uh, it's, it's just more n normal than your thought it was going to be in terms of an actual hockey game. Do you think there's going to be more? Uh, no, I think at the end of the day, once once the puck drops, once you start playing, you know, get a little body contact, get into the mix and into the flow of the game. It's right there. Yeah, it's just like any other thing. You kind of drown out the crowd and drown out the atmosphere and just kind of playing. And, you know, going off after periods and coming onto the ice, you can obviously kind of soak it up a little bit. But uh, this was a good day in the pond in terms of you know, like you guys were all talking about how you just have to shovel up the pond. You know, yeah. Yeah. No. We uh, the weather was very uh, very good to us. Uh, Mother Nature treated us good today. It was, uh, you know, there wasn't a whole lot of sun. It was a, a little little bit early on, but uh, a little overcast, a little crispy out. So there was. No snow, no rain. It was uh, it was perfect conditions. Yeah. Shot. Is that why you were diving? Well, it was kind of broken play, and I, I kind of tried to knock the puck out of, the, out of his hands, and I tried to reach it. So that's why I was on the ground, and you know, then he skated kind of under me and I fell down. Some of your teammates thought that they had too many men on the ice at the end of the game. Did you get a look at that? Oh, I, I didn't see that, but I heard. That there was actually six or seven guys on the ice, not just the one extra man. There was three extra men. So you know, if if you can't see that, that's you know, there's nothing we can do. But that's that's way too many men on the ice. <laughs> 